44 years old. Pfft, still got it. <laughs> I have new, more, I should say, gifts from people. And look, look at this one. <laughs> like, I don't know what the hell that is, but let's have a little check out. Let's have a little check out. Rambo the universe. There's no tomorrow. Oh, like there's no tomorrow. Space junk underscore galaxy. Oh, look at you. Galactic, galactic Trek universe, mate. Let's go. Hey, eh? thank you so much. Where, who's that from? Maybe it's from space junk underscore galaxy maybe hi caspersite i've been a fan of yours for a while and decided to make a custom channel shirt for you thank you so much galactic trek universe is a content creation channel dedicated to entertainment it's dangerous to go alone use this shirt as you rambo the wild and the freaky deaky paranormal world p.s our youtube team mate your youtube team is glitch wave underscore galaxy Maximum wrapping, please! Talking of pictures, mate, eh? Hey, this one is from Luis Perez. Thank you so much. I thought it was just a like a, a letter of mine or something. But I opened it up. Look at you, mate. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate that. I really appreciate that, buddy. It's epic. Right, let's have a little look at this. Oh, is this a poster? Ooh. Oh, I want to believe. Look at that, mate. That is, I think that's a quite um, a famous UFO picture, right? I'm sure it is. I don't know who's took it or where it's from, but that's epic. Mate, that's, oh, that's going up. I think that's going up. That's definitely going up. Hi, Casper. Ben, I sent you the X-Files DVD. Thank you very much. This is for your door, Ed, Devon. Mate, thank you so much, man. Um, I don't know if I'll put it on the door, but I'm going to put it somewhere. I'm going to put it somewhere. I might do. The bat's there now. And I don't want to crowd the door. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Although, I don't know, mate. I'm going to put it somewhere. I will put it somewhere, man. Thank you so much. I've got this one and then the big one, okay? This one is from Paul Hamilton. Again, mate, Paul, stop sending me stuff, mate. You've sent me far too much, okay? I've had it. Something to keep your face warm at night, mate. From Paul Hamilton. My face warm? Something to keep my face warm? It's alien. It's the alien thing. Yes, Paul, mate. Oh, thank you, buddy. That's sick. <laughs> right. Now for the, the big one. What is this? We'll find out today. What is this? A television or something? I tell you what, on bins day, mate, with the recycling, the, the, the recycling people must go off their heads when they see the amount of cardboard that comes out of my house. I must be thinking this guy just, just constantly buys things. Ooh, mate, it looks good quality. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Mate, get ready. Holy bejesus. Probably the greatest film, e well, one of the greatest films ever made. This film I have watched countless amount of times, okay? It is something that I think is almost like a bled, it's, it's just amazing. Look at this, mate. Holy moly. Holy moly. Oh my god. With 
mate. And we've got Trinity here, Neo, the kid with the spoon, Morpheus, Agent Smith, and what's this one? If I see that one, can we make that one out? But mate, look at that. Holy moly, man. That is absolutely epic. I'm gonna to have to show my missus a bit quickly. She says it's beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Who sent me that? Oh, hang on, there's a letter at the front. Hi Ben, just a quick note to say I found your channel a few months ago and watch one every night. You are so funny and you uh, cheer me up. Hope you like your gift. You deserve it. Thanks, Jill. Jill, that is absolutely amazing. I don't know where you got that from, but it's so amazing. Look at that certificate of authenticity. Authenticity. I know I get words mixed up. Like telepathy. Okay. Tele telepathy. Telepathy. That's right. Telepathy. Not telepathy. Telepathy. Okay? Right? It was just. Get over it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper's Eye. How the devil are you, mate? Today we're back with the freaky deaky, the horror, the paranormal, baby. Come on! And we're looking at a little channel called Fearsome Top 5. Make sure you go to his channel, subscribe, and do the thing, okay? This one is called Top 7 Scary Ghost Videos to Test Your Limits. Right. Is this going to be real? Is it going to be fake? Is it going to be freaky deaky? We'll find out today, okay? <laughs> Without further ado, Dad Dilly Day, let's do this. Shh. Go on, fearsome Top 5. I'm recording this. Okay, if we're recording. Welcome to Fearsome Top 5. Today we're taking a look at 7 scary ghost videos that you won't forget. Number 1. Number 1. A man that goes by mfalcon95 on Reddit posted a video that a friend sent him a while back of something unsettling. According to mfalcon95, his friend used to work late nights at an office building located in Corpus Christi, Texas. With full access to the security cameras, he would often keep an eye on them during his shift. Well, late one night, while he was alone in the building, something on the security camera monitor caught his eye. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Let's see that again, please. One more time. Wrong song. Different lyrics. Hang on. Something on the security camera monitor caught his eye. That's it. One more time. Monitor caught his eye. Oh, why is it glitching like that? Why is it matrixing like that? Huh? Why are you glitching, you shadow bastard? Oh, mate. Mate, that looks like a freaky hallway. I gotta be honest. Oh, my goodness gracious me. Let's go. Ramble it, mate. end of one of the hallways, a dark figure oh. was caught peeking out from behind a wall. Oh, mate, no, that's legit somebody just stood there, isn't it? I thought he was poking around the corner, but he's literally in the hallway. Out from behind a wall, 
This ominous figure quickly ducked back behind the corner, disappearing out of view. And as the man recorded, I think it was glitching because of the frames per second. And went to investigate that hallway. No one could be found. Oh! Whatever was peeking out at the end of the hall remains a mystery till this day. And if I was the guy who recorded it, I would simply use this video as my two-week notice. <laughs> Number two. Number two. Over on a TikTok account called Lauren Rose eight six seven, a woman named Lauren has only posted a handful of videos. Most of them being of her dog and her very interesting. The fuck is that? What is that? It looks like a walking bull bag. Sorry, but it does. It's got a dog's nose, human eyes, bat ears, and a body like a scrotum. What is that? It's not a cat. Don't put cat in the comments because it ain't. In cat. But back in 2020, while trying to record a video of her cat acting strange, she accidentally caught something terrifying. That's Other than the cat. Did you look at it? Oh, May. Okay, that wasn't her cat. That's her cat. That was a B-roll cat. But look at that. Do you see the shadow that just came across there like that? As her cat sat on the couch, staring off at something, a pitch black figure suddenly emerged. This chilling figure quickly walked through the room from right to left. Oh. And as it walked along the far back wall, it's, Lauren's the cat's cat looking didn't at it. seem to notice or move a muscle. According to Lauren, she has no idea how to explain this, but she went on oh. to post another video with a few details on the dark history of her home. Okay, so a lot of you guys have been asking me about the history of the house where I caught that ghost footage, so I figured I'd do a part two and tell you a little bit about it because it just adds a whole new layer of creepy as sh to what I saw. So the house was originally built in the 80s. Maximum microphone, please! And had only changed hands one other time besides the time that the original family lived there. Okay, so the original family designed a panic room and a bunker in the basement along with what we think are unfinished escape tunnels in the basement and in the garage. We were told that the tunnel in the garage hadn't been explored in a couple decades and so we were super excited to be the ones to explore this. Except for when we opened up the tunnel and started exploring, we discovered that the original owners of the house had left a backpack, a shovel, and a hammer in there. Normally something like this would be creepy until mm. we discovered that the original owner of the house went insane and- Sorry, side note. If you're watching and you have blue eyes, you're actually related to her. Fact. Let's move on. Murdered his wife with a hammer. He murdered his- I should also mention that the bunker and the panic room are both soundproof. So could the murder that took place in her home oh. be related to what she caught on camera? Yes, it could very well be, mate. It could very well be. That makes it all so more freaky deaky. I'll leave that up to you to decide. Mm. Number three. A Reddit user that goes by the seven foot fella posted a couple <laughs> videos of the strange things he recently experienced. Back in 2018, both his brother and father unfortunately passed away within a day of each other. And soon after their passing, he began to hear whispers, footsteps, and even see shadow figures. Mm. But it wasn't until just recently that he was able to catch proof of these experiences. You want the table? They're not supposed to be on there, huh? Happy boy. You happy? While recording. What was that, mate? That was running legit. Recording a video of his cat, the unsettling sound of footsteps rushing behind him caught his attention. You happy? Oh, mate, that's horrible. You happy? Both oh. him and his cat turned to look in the direction of these footsteps, but no one was there. And according to this Reddit user, he was completely alone at the time. Oddly enough, on another day while walking alone outside, he had a very similar experience. The... 
as the video begins. So he stopped walking and then the footsteps carried on. We can clearly hear the sound of his footsteps. But when he suddenly stopped walking and stood in place, the sound of footsteps continued. Oh, mate, that would be so darn freaky, that man. Oh, that's horrible. I don't know if that's worse. Is that worse than seeing something? Oh. He was completely alone when this video was recorded, leading me to believe that he may just have a spirit attachment that wants someone to hang out with. Number four. Number four. Back in 2021, during quarantine, a YouTube user that goes by Neon began learning how to play the piano. And after starting to get the hang of it, he decided to record a video of himself playing a song. So while his grandma was asleep downstairs, he set up his camera and began to play. But throughout the video, strange things began to happen. Hmm. All right, what's up, guys? Uh, Neon here. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm the quarantine, and I'm trying to learn the piano. So yeah, yeah, leave some comments down in the in the comment section for any suggestions of songs that you guys want me to try and learn. Robin uh, Miles, children. Uh, right now, I'm gonna I think I've seen this one. I guess one that I learned. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Yeah, I've seen this one. I don't know what happens though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! oh no, that's his head. Okay, that's his head right there. I think he yeah, he goes to check it out. I've seen this one. I'm not i I'm not convinced about this one, mate. Okay, so the door just opened. Oh I know, I know, I know what happens. Um I know. As you can see right here. I there the you are! <laughs> and, um... I don't know, man. It just looks so like... Oh, I don't know. It just looks... i got to be honest. It looks, it looks poo, right? It just looks poo. I was recording. Like, it just... It literally looks like somebody wearing... You know the the scream outfit that you can get, yeah. I don't know. However, that's weird. That circle thing that might be some sort of light reflecting in the lens. But look at that, mate. I remember seeing that for the first time, thinking Sonic the Hedgehog's gonna jump out here in a minute, collect his ring, peace. <laughs> it's just over there. I think that's the and, reflection of the um, light. The door opened. That was interesting. Okay. Um. I'm just gonna go back into my room and completely ignore that that happened. The door just closed again, but the other door. Um, I'm not gonna have any of that. I'm just gonna close the door and completely ignore that. And now his mate's underneath the As bed again. The, I, piano, I don't know. the door behind him suddenly swung open, quickly catching his attention. Now confused, he got up to investigate, but no one was outside of his room. He then angled his camera towards the desk he was sitting at, only to reveal a tall, dark figure. Oh, yeah, 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 of course, it's the reflection of the ring light. Standing in the room, against the closet door, this ominous figure stood completely motionless, and somehow Neon didn't seem to notice. Now, I think he did. Obviously, I can't say for sure if this video is genuine. But regardless, whatever this is, is giving me a major case of the heebie-jeebies. Imagine if that was legit, though. <laughs> if that shit is actually legit. <laughs> Run! Number five. Number five. YouTube user Resonance2001 posted a video back in 2015 of a chilling experience he had. Eight years ago, he decided to visit the Lincoln City Cathedral. Located in Lincoln, England, this mm. massive structure was built in the 14th century and at one point was the tallest building in the world. Wow! Well, in the 1960s, wow. a woman named Constance leapt from one of the cathedral's towers to her death. Until this day, people report seeing the ghostly apparition of a woman outside of the church. 
Well, as Resonance 2001 was recording a video of the cathedral at night, he had a downright chilling experience. What? Oh! Oh, look! Here! This seems familiar again. I think that I've seen it. Look at you, though! Look at you! Is it that? Is that it? Are we looking at that? We are looking at that. It's still there, mate. Oh, my God! Oh, wow! Wow, 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 wow! Oh, mate, it's more freaky the second time I see it, man. What the actual F? Oh, mate, how it slowly disappears. And I can't see any cut there. With the bells going off as well. Oh, the bells. Oh. Oh, man. As he panned his camera to the right, he noticed something or someone staring at him from behind the stone wall. He gathered his courage and inched forward to get a closer look at whatever this is. But as he got within reach, the figure drifted back behind the wall. Oh. And as he turned the corner, no one was there. So could this be the ghost of the woman that leapt from the top of the cathedral? Oh. And is the man recording one of the bravest men on earth? Because if Hey, I that was freaky, man. Just imagine, though, she did lunge to her death. And that's her spirit just flapping around every night. Yeah? Confused. And regretting what she's done. Oh. I saw that, I'd immediately be running the other way. Number six. Number six! Over on a YouTube channel called Past Hauntings, a paranormal team conducts investigations of locations that are said to be haunted. And in one of these investigations, Haunted. they found themselves at the Colston Bassett Church ruins. And as they explored this old structure in the middle of the night, something unnerving was caught on camera. Oh, wow! What the F was that? As they walked past one of the windows in the stone wall, a faint apparition came wow. on the other side. This pale figure moved towards the left before disappearing completely. At first glance, some may just write this off as a reflection. Mate, no, that's that seems pretty legit, that mate, I'm telling you. Because I don't know, it's just You would have to mask it over here as well, that old grainy ass footage. It doesn't look like a human shape, it looks like some sort of manifestation. You'd have to mask it here, 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 here. Oh, Off as a reflection in the window. But that's impossible as there's no glass in any of the windows. Uh. According to the past hauntings team, all members were accounted for at the time. So whoever or whatever this is still remains a mystery. Number seven. Number seven. Chris from the Urbex Hill YouTube channel hey, recently went on a solo investigation in an old abandoned school. After being left untouched for decades, this now deteriorating building looks like something straight out of a horror movie. But Fine. late into the night, Chris bravely made his way inside. Do you know what? I was actually going to react to this one, I think. I can't remember. I think I was going to react to this one. Sure of what to expect. Look at the state of that. There's a lot of movement down there. You hear that? Yeah. It sounds like somebody's down there. Immediately after making it inside, Chris couldn't ignore the strange noises coming from somewhere nearby. 
and after setting up multiple IR cameras throughout the building, he continued exploring when he found something strange. Hey, that looks dodgy, man. It's like this weird string. It's so they know where they're going. So they don't That's get lost. A booby trap. trap. Isn't that a booby trap supposed to be invisible? <laughs> Goes all the way up. That's weird. Oh, mate. And it goes this way. It stops right there. Goes all the way back. Follow it, mate. Check it out later. This peculiar string going throughout the building wow. is an eerie indicator that someone has been lurking inside mate. and could potentially be waiting just around any corner. With this thought in mind, Chris continued through the halls. Imagine going into an abandoned building and seeing that string going through the hallways in the middle, like just floating in the middle of the hallways, just going all the way around. That would be freaky, man. Somebody's here. Rambo it, mate. Someone's gotta be here. Get down there and Rambo it. Probably homeless people. Cut for time. Oh, mate. Oh, mate. That's chains. What the hell was that? That was chains, Unsettling mate. Unsettling sounds coming from somewhere in the building immediately put Chris on edge. And while all these noises were happening, the IR camera Chris had set up in the auditorium caught something downright bone chilling. It's running fast, mate. It's running fast. Oh, God. In the very back of the auditorium, an unnerving dark figure can be seen oh. quickly moving past the auditorium door. Oh, it goes past the other way, too. Doors. This eerie black figure moved incredibly fast as it traveled through the hall. Oh, my God. That's horrible, mate. That's absolutely horrible. Something about the way that it moved didn't exactly look human. Completely unaware of what oh. was just caught on camera, Chris continued exploring the old school until he discovered something incredibly chilling. Get down there, mate. Get down there. 
and Rambo this shit. That's it. That's it. Somebody's down there. Oh my god, mate. This is going to be some naked creature thing there who can just talk and just goes, Are you here to help me? Are you here to help me? Please help me. Oh god. Do not enter, mate. Slam dunk that shit and get in there. What the hell was that noise? Wait a minute. This wasn't like this before. What? Oh, mate, somebody's oh, in there. Wow. Somebody's moved it in. Somebody's I do in. not remember this being here. Someone's in there, mate. Is somebody behind that thing? Is that an opening behind that thing? Move it! Hello? After walking through the old gym, Chris... Hello. Oh, mate, good cliffhanger. ...noticed that something was now out of place. A white metal grate was now propped up against the door. And if we take a look at his footage from earlier in the night, there was clearly nothing in front of this door. Oh! And the metal grate was so someone's in the there! Side. Now, with it being moved, it became evident to Chris that he was not alone in the building. You're not alone! But unfortunately, this is where the video ends. Oh, no! No! Are you kidding me? Erbex Hill, are you kidding me? So the next video, you're gonna open that up and get in there, aren't you? Lick it. Oh yes, motorbike. Lick it, yeah! But luckily, a part two is on the way. In the meantime, do we think this is something paranormal or a dangerous person oh, lurking in the building? Oh my god, way, nothing moves that quick, mate, apart from me. And you saying bolt. Hey, Chris is f nuts for going inside to find <laughs> out. Make sure to follow me on Instagram to hear more from your boy. Yeah. There you go, mate. That was pretty darn good, don't you think? Anyway, thank you so much for watching, man. I hope you liked it. And please come back for another video. Take care. Bye-bye.